Hi guys, Piotr here. This is Light Finance Global YouTube channel and it's my pleasure to be with you again. Today we are going to discuss smart trading strategy which is working very well with Forex, crypto, futures market and stock market. I'm going to show you three different examples how you may want to approach. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. All right, guys, it's going to be very, very easy uh, and uh, well, as usual, I'm going to provide you a few examples, but then you have to do your own research. You have to do your own homework. You have to try at least hundreds of examples before risking real money. So what is all about? First thing first, we are going to add into the chart MACD with the standard setup. That's the thing number one. Thing number two, we are going to apply 200 moving average, all right? And finally, we are going to switch to the five minute chart. And as I mentioned, is it going, is it going to work uh, almost on each and every market with the proper money management in place, uh, you should be profitable. Of course, you have to avoid over trading. That's the point number one. And you have to strictly stick into the rules. You may want to apply uh, another filters, like for example, support and resistance from the higher time frames. All right. So as I've mentioned, there are three different approaches. The standard one. All right, let's start with the standard one. Well, if we are going to look for short setup, first thing first, the price has to be below 200 moving average on five minute chart. The 200 moving average has to pointing downward and the price has to be as close as possible to 200 moving average, all right? So for example, here, all right, we will have a go because we are very close. Now, what we have to have on the MACD? In that case, we are taking into the consideration when the tree is coming below uh, the signal line, all right, or we are crossing from the positive to negative territory, okay? So let's have a look what we have here. And how that would work, okay? So that would be, that would be our setup on the next candle with the stop above most recent high in that case, double top, right? And we are targeting 3R. So our risk reward, right, is 3R. So in that case, it worked well, okay? Now, we also have this type of the approach when we were crossing lower here, but 200 moving average was pointing higher and we were with the price above. So this setup of going short was not valid, all right? So that's the point number one. Let's have a look uh, if it's working the same way when it comes to, uh, when it comes to the Bitcoin. Let's try to find because here we have some kind of the consolidation as you can see so let's move back a bit and let's have a look if we have something similar on the bitcoin when it comes to the downtrend all right so guys we are approaching towards 200 a moving average right and we are slipping 
below the signal line, right? So there was a short setup over here. Let's check if it's worked our way, okay? In that case, again, it worked our way, correct? That's how it works. Let's get back into the FX market. We have also the crude and the NASDAQ we are going to discuss a second ago. Uh, we are going to discuss within second, few seconds. Let's get back into the Forex and let's discuss the second example of the possible, of the possible setup. In that case, uh, we are going to trade against the trend. We are going to trade against the trend. What we are looking for, we are looking for the three drive setup on MACD, all right? We are looking for three, uh, three run setup and uh, that's when we want to try to make the counter trend, uh, counter trend move. We have to be well below, if market is going lower, all right? And we have three run on the MACD, we want to be far away from, uh, from the moving average, all right? We want to be uh, as far away as possible. So uh, in case of this three drive over here, all right? Well, I would be, even it worked out, I would be very, very cautious trying to trade this one because we were not that far away. But anyway, if we are going to place uh, the line when the market, when the tree got back again, okay, over here, okay, as you can see, that would, if we would trade that one, okay, that would be stop out. On the other hand, this three drive with this spike higher, even the market went, uh, when it comes to the MACD higher, we never hit that stop, okay? So this worked very, very well uh, trying to trade against the trend. Now, it's very important to remember this three R at least risk reward ratio. It's not going to work each and every time, of course, but guys, what is important? Important thing here is that even if we are correct just three, four times out of the 10, right? So the first one is correct, uh, three points. Second is correct, three points. Third is correct, three points, all right? And then fourth to 10th, all right, losers, so minus, minus six. So overall, as you can see, we are still in profit, okay? That's very, very important. And the last one, and we are going to switch, uh, we are going to switch to uh, different, uh, it's not visible on the crude, where it was visible. I'm going to show you the third example how you may want to approach this, uh, this one. It's uh, simply uh, taking into the consideration uh, the head and shoulder on MACD, not on the price, but uh, trying to find uh, head and shoulder. It's not going to be, it's not going to be uh, very, very uh, often. Uh, it's not going to happen, but this type of the approach, all right? Trying to trade, uh, trying to trade uh, to the to the downside uh, with the approach of the uh, head and shoulders, but on the MACD. So let's have a look on the few other examples. Uh, so let's have a look um, if one of these uh, could happen. Here is the head and shoulder as well. Okay, and the same the same way you may wanna try to trade. Uh, inverted head and shoulder, all right, over here and trying to, for example, go long. So let's have a look, let's exa examine uh, the, uh, the NASDAQ and 
uh, trying to find uh, the right and correct uh, setup if there were something there were something for uh, for us uh, on the on the Nasdaq. So here we were pointing uh, here we were pointing higher, and then uh, we got back very very close to very close to the 200 moving average. We were crossing on the tree, so that was the perfect setup to try to go uh, long, for example. So this one is working uh, working well. Uh, with this type uh, of the uh, of the approach, right? Then it was the possible head and shoulder over here, right? With the move back uh, below, attempt to try to go uh, to go lower. The first trade was the possible to uh, hit the stop, but with the cross to the downside, it was possible to uh, set up the short again. So that's how it works with the uh, with the indices, for example. Let's try to find a little bit more examples. We were pointing when it comes to the uh, 200 moving uh, average. We were uh, pointing higher, uh, and the setup to try to go to try to go long. So as you can see, uh, working well with indices. Let's have a look what we have when it comes to the crude oil. All right. So we have a three drive Riley, one, two, three, with the move back below somewhere over here. And that was the nice and big short setup. Okay. So it working with the futures market as well. And finally, let's have a look when it comes to the Bitcoin. Uh, we've seen uh, quite a few setups over here. Let's have a look if we have uh, if we have something uh, something more. Uh, there was a three drive Riley, as you can see here. One, two, three, and somewhere here the short setup against the against the trend. So guys, again, it's not the holy grail. It's not going to work 100% of the time, but using the simple strategy with MACD and 200 uh, moving average, you can easily create your own trading strategy. You can add your uh, additional filters. So hopefully you are going to do your own research. You are going to do hundreds of examples before you are going to risk uh, the money. Wish you great and perspective tr next trading day. Uh, with that being said, thank you very much. Take care and goodbye.